Today's horoscope from Astro Academy, Leo March 5, 2023. With Venus and Chiron aligning in your solar house, you get the chance to dig deep and get to the heart of a relationship or private matter. It's a time for emotional repair, healing, and deep understanding. It's also a good day for discovering what or who you value and for such things as research and analysis with an extra dose of intuition working on your side. Emotional honesty is vital now, and fortunately, it comes naturally today. You are courageous but also very sensitive in the face of new discoveries, even if they seem to touch on a soft spot. In fact, you may be going right for that soft spot since the desire to repair is compelling. You have outrageously lucky stars bringing attention to your love life and partnerships. As mental Mercury, the cosmic messenger of the mind and interaction, swims into the reefs across the sky from you, prepare for an ease to communications with your partner. Where you stand and how you can make plans will be paramount at this time until March 19th. Finding balance and a middle ground will happen with ease. While you're immensely logical, this is a time to be soft and sensitive with what you feel and also let your partner lead, rather than just expecting them to follow. You have more control than you think. Something may arise that takes a hit on your professional and financial security as Venus in Aries conjuncts Chiron in Aries. It could be extrinsic or intrinsic, but regardless of what the trigger is, you may feel unsure of yourself. It can be daunting to know what to invest in or who is on your side at work. Think of this conjunction as your cosmic cue to work on feeling confident in your self-sufficiency and independence to move forward with your professional matters. Just days after aligning with Jupiter in your financial sector, something that has created a new sense of financial confidence and optimism, Venus has caught up with and aligns with Chiron today. This time it is the planets of money and healing coming together, with a chance to lay old financial ghosts or doubts to rest. Jupiter has left you with a sense of what's possible with a chance now to lay to rest the things real or imagined that are stopping you. The day's planetary energy can be of great benefit to you. The aspect at play asks you what you need to feel good and helps you by highlighting the areas in life that matter to your health. The planets do not lie. They may make you see the world through rose-colored glasses at times, but they can also give you the facts of the matter in easy-to-understand terms. For instance, diet and exercise? Water as an element of life? Be sure that you create the type of environment you enjoy the most. The essence of this day can give your sense of color and design a real boost, so why not take advantage of this? Whether it's your workspace or home environment, Applying the day's creative energy toward enhancing the spaces you spend so much time in can really help. It can give you a feeling of the new and refreshed, and this will bring more energy to you every day. Give it a try. When Mercury left your work sector yesterday he left Saturn on his own, but just days away from leaving himself this has left you with everything needed to keep your head in the game and to remain mentally focused. At the same time, in his first full day in your relationship sector, Mercury is giving you a chance to get the communication lines open ahead of Saturn's return next week and in a way that only the planet of communication can. While Mercury and Saturn are no longer together they are still working as a team. In his first full day in your relationship sector, Mercury has a chance to get the communication lines open ahead of not only Saturn's return in four days but of a full moon in Virgo that on the same day will put a balance between your personal and relationship needs to the test. This will be key to better understanding what you want from your relationships and what they need from you, with having the communication lines open ahead of time a real advantage. Our Eyes in the Sky Today, Venus the planet of love, beauty, and harmony, forms a conjunction with Chiron, the centaur associated with healing and transformation, in the fiery sign of Aries. This celestial event signals a powerful day of change and healing in matters of the heart. As Venus and Chiron align in Aries, we are prompted to reflect on our past decisions concerning love and romance. This cosmic influence urges us to re-evaluate any past hurts or heartaches and find ways to heal and move forward. 
It's an opportune time to implement growth and positive change into our lives. If you've been carrying any guilt or emotional baggage from past relationships, this is the perfect time to release it. Letting go can be a cathartic experience, allowing you to free yourself from any negative patterns or beliefs that may be holding you back from experiencing the love and happiness you deserve. Take advantage of this celestial energy and embrace the opportunity to heal, grow, and transform your love life. It's time to create a brighter, more fulfilling future by learning from the past and making positive changes in the present. The Cancer Moon and Pluto in Capricorn create a challenging opposition in the morning, which can trigger feelings of fear and helplessness. We may feel like we are facing insurmountable obstacles that are preventing us from achieving our goals or finding personal happiness. This aspect can also highlight power dynamics within our relationships or institutions. We may feel like powerful people or organizations are standing in the way of our success, and we may struggle to assert our own authority in these situations. However, it's important to remember that our perceptions may be distorted by our fears and anxieties. We may be assigning more power and authority to these external forces than they actually have, and we may be responding to them as if they are a direct threat to our well-being. As the moon enters its void of course following this aspect, it's best to avoid making any important decisions until our judgment is less clouded by these intense emotions. This is a time for reflection and introspection, allowing us to gain a clearer understanding of our fears and how they may be impacting our relationships and decision-making. Instead of giving in to our fears and anxieties, we can use this opposition as an opportunity to face our deepest fears and gain a sense of empowerment. By acknowledging our fears and taking proactive steps to address them, we can cultivate a sense of inner strength and resilience that can help us navigate even the most challenging obstacles in our lives. In less than an hour after the challenging opposition between the Cancer Moon and Pluto in Capricorn, the Moon enters the playful and creative sign of Leo, marking the end of its void of course. This shift in energy brings a light-hearted and joyful vibe that lasts for the next two days. During this time, we may feel a stronger emotional connection to pleasure, play, and our inner child. We are more expressive of our feelings and desire to make others feel special, as we crave the same in return. The spotlight may feel natural to us, and we may enjoy being the center of attention. However, this energy can also bring a tendency to stir up drama when faced with boredom or a lack of excitement. We may feel the need to create a sense of excitement or drama to keep things interesting, which can sometimes lead to conflicts or unnecessary tension. It's important to be mindful of this tendency and find healthy ways to channel our creative energy and desire for playfulness. This is a great time to explore new hobbies or engage in activities that bring us joy and fulfillment. We can also use this energy to express ourselves creatively and connect with our inner child in a positive and constructive way.